Hey guys, welcome back. This is part two of the video where we continue to work on the $8 Facebook Marketplace air compressor. Let's get into it. Okay guys, next project is to do something about this filter. So what I think I'm gonna do is just cut a custom piece. I picked this up at uh, Lowe's or Home Depot. I can't remember which one. Uh, it's, it's five or six bucks. Uh, it's basically so you can cut custom size filters. I'm gonna put that in next. Okay guys, here's what I've drawn out for the front feet. Um, I'm gonna use some quarter 20 bolts just to fit through the foot. This will be kind of like the side of it. It's gonna be uh, 50 millimeters of diameter, 25 millimeters high. So kind of short and, and round. And then a through hole with a countersink from the bottom to hide the, the quarter 20 the quarter 20 screw I'm going to put in there. Okay guys, here they are. Here's the feet. The screws will be countersunk in there. These will sit flat against the ground. Let's go put them on. Alright, quarter 20 screw goes in here. Let's just make sure the screw fits. I probably should have checked that earlier. We're good. It's nice there. Sorry for the hand in the way. Give me a second and I'll get it out of the way once I get this started. All right. There's one side. Move my makeshift jack around and get the other side in. And we'll see how it sets. Uh, all right. 
not too bad. There's the feet. There's the wheels. All right, here's my problem with the handle. I have a piece of half inch conduit I was planning to use as a base of my handle, but it just doesn't fit. So I tried doing a couple bends with my conduit bender. And uh, I got it formed pretty much the way I wanted. And this right here is a quarter 20 screw thread. And I drilled a hole in and I was gonna attach this, this little handle. And then I was gonna put another piece that went along the end. But I, honestly, I'm, I'm just not happy with how this turned out. So scrapping the handle for now, I'm gonna keep working on that. Uh, I'm not gonna have it done in time for this video, but that's where we're at. All right, let's, uh, let's do a test run now that we got wheels and feet and see how it looks. Definitely much more stable. I think it's going to work. Hey, that's all we have for today, guys. Uh, I'll probably end up doing a part three on this, uh, one last part as I continue to work with it. Um, I think I'll probably change the oil again in part three and see if I can figure out that handle. If you've got any ideas or what I should do about a handle or any other thing to do with this compressor, I'm so pleased with it. It's such a great find. Let me know in the comments. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. All right. Thanks a lot. We will see you next time.